on April 1st, 2023, the world was introduced to the Ghost of Molly McGee Season 2. And it is genuinely one of the worst fucking pieces of media that I've ever been subjected to. I don't understand how anyone can enjoy this vapid, asinine, and abominable piece of horseshit. The Ghost of Molly McGee is fucking horrible, and you should feel like a horrible person for enjoying it. This is such a fucking step down from Season 1 that it's not even funny. The difference in quality is wider than the fucking specific ocean. We went from Paws of Fury, The Legend of Hank, to deciding to fucking hedgehog too. That is the level of dog shit that we're dealing with here. Hi, I'm the PG Tomer, and today I'm going to be giving a public service announcement because the Ghost of Molly McGee has evolved into a cancerous fucking biohazard and should not be watched by fucking anybody. Okay, so there's really one main issue with this season. This is literally the most uninteresting that the show has ever been. I mean, they completely ditched the plot line about the head ghost in charge and add in some new neighbors as villains. Like, nigga, what the fuck? That's some of the laziest bullshit that I've ever seen in a show. The ghost of Marlon McGee didn't need a fucking Ned Flanders clown. They needed a fucking serialized story. Why the fuck should I care about the lives of some shittily drawn cartoons that apparently lost 90% of their animation budget between seasons? Like, come the fuck on. This show probably has a budget of millions of dollars, and these nine pitiful fucking episodes are the best that they can do. And don't even get me started on the period episode. That is the worst fucking thing that I've seen on TV since the Juneteenth slavery episode in the Proud Family. I am fucking ashamed that these people get the shit all over true God-fearing patriots like me and spewing a divisive fucking political bullshit agenda and still get to call themselves Americans. If I can use one word to describe the Democrat fucks that are manipulating the country to their own advantage, then human wouldn't be one of them. They are some cutaneous, disgusting slime balls who want to indoctrinate our children with wokeness and dark and deviant fucking ideals. I am so sick and fucking tired of these diabolical dipshits getting everything while people like me are fucking shortchanged and left in the fucking dust! What the fuck did I ever do to deserve this horrible fucking show? I've done literally fucking nothing wrong, and yet these bastards decide to go ahead and fuck up season two of the Ghost of Molly McGee. This is so fucking unfair. Nobody's ever suffered as much as I am right now. Fucking hell. The Democrats can't give me away with this. Anyway, that was my review of the Ghost of Molly McGee season two. <laughs> Needless to say, it's definitely a step down from season one, and you should definitely stay the hell away from this terrible fucking show. Either way, I'm in a PG tumor, deleting all of my Ghost of Milo McGee fan fictions on Wattpad, and signing off. Bye!